Ever since I remember, I always wondered how are these satellites launched into orbits even when they have these huge solar panels. Well, now I know. They use magic. Yes, a very old paper magic. It's called origami. Origami, a traditional Japanese art of folding paper into attractive shapes to create decorative objects. Sounds cute and simple, right? But origami can be used to create huge and complex 2D and 3D structures which can be folded into shapes which will fit into tiny spaces. For example, a satellite can use origami to make solar panels which will be only unfolded when we want to charge the satellite. Wet blocks plus origami. Cool, right? Excited to see how the structure works? Let's go. In this project, we will be using a power motor driver plus dark and invert. Remember, you can also use wiretap with these blocks. Now, in the solar panel structure, we have used pulley mechanism with thread, sliders and compressed solar panels. In this structure, we have used a folded sheet the sheet is stuck at one end and tied to the slider from the two corners at the other two end. Now, when a satellite detects the sun rays with the help of dark blocks, the motor will start rotating and the sliders will be pulled down opening the solar panels. Our Witblocks Maker Challenge number 53 is a great example of a solution that requires thinking while using two different skills. I know you are very excited to participate in this challenge. So, all you need to do to participate in this challenge is build a project, shoot its video and upload it on the Witblocks app. Remember, the last date to participate in this challenge is 23rd of March. Also note that two lucky makers will be selected as the winners for this challenge. The first maker will be selected for the maximum number of likes and the second winner will be selected for the best design by the Witblocks team itself. Both the winners will be getting the latest touch blocks as the grand prize. So what are you waiting for? Build a project and claim your prizes. Best of luck for your challenge.